Here we are at Stenson Lock. This is the first wide lock since Middlewich and they're all wide from now on. Franz just popped up to set it and uh, we'll be going through in a second. This is taking quite a while. There's only one paddle working. Lumpy. That one wasn't. That one wasn't so sweet. <laughs> uh oh, what are you doing, friend? What do you mean? Uh oh, it's not even midday. Yeah, but um, I've been black burying. Not picked a massive amount. It's a little bit early, but I've got a few. They're not very big either, but they're going to be enough to make blackberry gin which we're going to stash away for Christmas. So I've got about half a bottle here. That may not be enough, but we'll see how we go. I'm just going to pop the blackberries in the bottle, then sprinkle on enough sugar just to cover them, giving it a little bit of shake so the sugar goes down in between all the berries, and then top it up with um, gin. So I may have to pick some more because I don't think these are going to quite half fill this bottle. And if there's not enough gin, I might have to buy another bottle of gin as well. A half bottle, friend. <laughs> but it seems to be a bit of a vicious cycle, is it? Because you you buy the gin and then there's too much, so you start making another bottle of blackberry gin, and then there's not quite enough gin and you have to buy more. And it just goes on like that between <laughs> now and Christmas, really. <laughs> but here we go. And once it's in, then you just um, give it a shake every, I don't know, week or so. And, um, and leave it, and it really quickly goes purple, beautiful colour. And you can do this with any fruit, you can do it with raspberries and rhubarb. So don't go off buying all your fancy posh gins. You just need cheap old gin, a bit of sugar and a bit of fruit, and play. I reckon that will do. Oh no, I've got to buy more gin. <laughs> oh, we could put more blackberries in, but do you know what? I think that'll be fine. Beautiful. Now, just to find somewhere to hide it so we can't drink it before Christmas. <laughs>
Well, we're off for a walk, just a three or four mile loop around the villages of Swarkston and Melbourne. And uh, down a disused rail track when we get off the canal. And then we're going to cross the longest stone spanned bridge in the country, apparently, which dates back to the 12th century. I've got a feeling we go along beside it because I think it's quite a busy road now and um, yeah. it, it's flooding floodplain or near some ponds and lakes so hopefully we can get through um, but we will see it looks like a lovely walk doesn't it it does it does August hasn't proven to be the best of weather so far it's been a bit wet hasn't it, it has been wet they're forecasting an Indian summer at the end of the month but then we don't take a lot of notice of that but we woke up this morning, got up quite early actually, and there was a real difference in the air and the, the light quality. There was condensation on the windows because it's been a little bit cold, but walking around, everything has suddenly changed in the last few days. The berries are all ripening, elderberries are ripening, blackberries, seeds are all ripening in the hedgerow. And it just feels like there's a little tease of autumn in the air and it's lovely. It is. We love autumn. It's, uh, next to spring, it's our favourite uh, time of year. You don't often hear us um, wishing it was the heat of summer. It's spring and autumn, and there are things about winter that we love as well. Um, but yeah, it's just it's a lovely day for a walk. Well, let's do it then. Come on then. All clear? Yep. <laughs> the 
looking forward to another night out. Um, this time, towpath drinks and, well, it's barbecue a barbecue, nibbles. but we're taking pizza with us because <laughs> we don't really do barbecues uh, with somebody that I know lots of you are going to know. Yeah, it's been a while since we caught up with him and uh, is out and about on his travels on the canal, free from the marina. So we're looking forward to a catch up. Yeah, very much so. Is my hair all right? You'll do. <laughs> But Gary, what you're doing now, you're continually cruising. What's the best thing? It's seeing, I, I've watched all your vlogs. I've been yeah. stuck in a marina. <laughs> well, I, I watch yours sometimes. But I've been, um, I've been sort of stuck in local waters. So it, it's seeing what Joe and Michael, what yourselves, what David, what everybody else is vlogging. And, and finally, I'm meeting these places. I'm going there. Hawkesbury Junction, Fradley Junction. Uh, Dale agrees. <laughs> it's going to these different places and, and, and actually seeing them and, and taking chugs. It's a different it. life, isn't it? When it's, you're out filming the marina. It, it's being able to breathe. Yeah. We've had Do you miss it? Do you miss the marina? Not one bit. No. I miss the people there. Yeah. And I, it's not that I hated marina life. I love marina life. I loved it because I'm on the boat anyway. But the boat is made for moving. Yeah, it is. It's made for yeah. cruising and it's made for visiting places. Why would you have a boat and be stuck in one place? Yeah. And that's not me. So where's so. next on your list then, do you think? Where is oh. there, what place is there that you think I really, really want to go there? San Francisco. Would be nice. <laughs> and the narrow boat. The, the, the American loop, apparently. Yeah, 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 yeah. The dogs are going mad. Um, no, um, I've no real goals because we've got two and a half thousand miles to go and see. Yeah. So it's 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 an open door, isn't it? We feel the same. You just keep going until you've had enough, don't yeah, you? Yeah, really? winter will be a different experience because yeah. obviously I've got winter to come. Mm. Hi. Hello. Hiya. Hiya. Hi. Hi. I've got winter yeah. to come, so um, I don't know what I'm going to do really. So that'll be. You might even find it easier moving rather than sitting still in a marina well but you yeah. might go back might you so but i'm, I'm a wimp and i don't like the cold don't so we'll that. see how we get on i don't believe that we'll see minute. how we get on <laughs> but i'm gonna have archie anyway yeah. he's he's coming to live on chugs now aren't you archie <laughs> new yes. friend <laughs> yeah he's my little mate so yeah it's, it's all new experience yeah. isn't it it's good it's anything new is good but and it's good, you... good to see you looking so happy anyway i'm, I'm feeling better yeah So one week on, I've dug the gin out of its difficult to get to hiding place just to check on it. And um, look at that colour, that's fab. So we're supposed to stir this weekly or mix it weekly, but I figure the movement of the boat will do that. So I'm gonna hide it away somewhere even more difficult to get to this time and hopefully leave it till Christmas. So we haven't tried it and topped it up yet, have we? I couldn't possibly say. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.